before we move into the semis and the final. And away they go into that first turn, and Wofferden's made a good one off the inside run. Now, can he keep Smarslik at bay? Smarslik on the inside run, but Wofferden holds the line. Here comes Smarslik at the inside. Wofferden now has got to clamp the line to deny Smarslik, and Zadar coming around the outside and having a go. The man of the back, disappointingly for Matsyanovsky of Poland, but Smarslik is pushing Wofferden hard at the inside. Yeah, it's done him this time. Once again, the world champion, absolutely determined to get to the front. Wofferden initially super away from the tapes and uh, just wasn't able to resist the charge from the championship leader there and got to say this is good news for Smarslik he's going to finish on 13 points he's going to overhaul Laguta Laguta and Smarslik going into the semi-finals just a point between them once again on the night Smarslik has now cleared off out in front Wuffenden with two points, that's enough for the semi-finals for him. Yes, absolutely, but Smarsley convincing in the end, and Wuffenden will be disappointed with that. Striving for speed from the engine, but out, outpaced by Bartos Bart Smarsley there. They get on great, these two, there's huge respect between the two of them, but mm. there's no doubt Smarsley has got more speed in the engine than Wuffenden there. Yeah, I would say he's got more confidence as well, Nice. Yes. I think the two go hand in hand a bit. And Smarslik rode nicely to get the better of Wuffenden there. Yep, Wuffenden in second spot, but that is enough for him to finish on a double-figure haul of 10 points. He's in the semis. Smarslik on 13 now will top the scorers going into the semi-finals as we prepare for heat number 20. So, advantage Smarslik again. Yes, it is. A nice start from Wuffenden on the inside. And it looked like Wuffenden was going to be able to win this but uh, you've got to give credit to Smarslik, who wrote really strongly to actually get the better of Wuffenden by charging up the inside. He actually tried the move once, it didn't quite work, and then uh, the second time of asking, there was a bit more room, and he was able to sweetly move up the inside and get the better of Wuffenden, and then moving on. And once he does hit the front, I'll tell you what, he shows great speed, and that's uh, a bit of a marker down to Artem Laguto, who I'm sure was keenly looking on. And a lot of respect between those two boys, as you rightly say, five world championships.